Today we're going to be talking about Fighter Challenge Pack 5 and why they're probably coming sooner than we think and there's a lot of evidence coming directly from Nintendo on this one. Before we hop into today's video first I just want to say join my public discord. Um, I kind of just reorganized my discord recently and I want to get something going and create a server where you guys can all hang out and just talk about Smash and whatever whatever video games it doesn't matter but you know I just want to you know grow the community a little bit more but anyways let's hop right back into the video. So usually around the time when a new fighter is about to release, they put up the fighter challenger pack thingy on the eShop. As you can see right here on the screen, you can actually go in the eShop right now and actually go to this and see this for yourself. But they actually put this up around the time the, you know, the next fighter is about to come out. And of course it has the deadline which is February 29th and I doubt it will be that long till we get the next character. It doesn't really make logical sense because you know it's just a placeholder date in case of deadline. Similar to the Piranha Plant situation, he actually ended up coming out January 30th or something like that. So it didn't even end up being that far into the future. So I don't think you guys need to worry about the February 29th release date, it's just a placeholder date. So what does Challenger Pack 5 being up on eShop mean? It means we're most likely getting a Nintendo Direct this month with a Smash reveal because we usually get a January Direct and I feel like the character will come out this month. If not this month, first week of February. Hold me to that. If I'm wrong, I will literally like eat my shoe. So I do think that the most likely character is Cosmos at the moment. And actually, my last video was about that, so if you guys want to go check that out, you can go check that out. It should be at the end of the video in the title card, or uh, in the description below or something. But with that said, um, I'm not going to go too much further into predictions, because I feel like I kind of want to save that for an entire Nintendo Direct predictions type video. Because I, I want to branch out a little bit more into more Nintendo things, because I enjoy more than just Smash, because Smash includes a lot of Nintendo. But some of my predictions about the Nintendo Direct, but not necessarily the contents, would be I feel like the Nintendo Direct is going to be in a week or two from now. It's going to be not too long from the beginning of January. I feel like it might maybe stretch till the, the middle of January. And this is where we'll probably see the next reveal for the character. Because like I said guys in my previous video, or actually before the previous video, where I talk about when the final DLC character is coming, because we pretty much have an idea of when the character is coming, and it's got to be this month. Just a lot of things just point towards it, like I said, it being up on the eShop is a big, big thing, and I really feel like we can expect to see a new character for the end of the month. I know this video was extremely short, but honestly there isn't that much to talk about and I just wanted to let a lot of you guys know because I haven't seen too many people actually speak about this. So with that said, I hope you guys enjoy the video and I hope you're enjoying your beginning of 2020. Uh, let's make some big moves out here and let's grow this channel and see if we can actually reach 10k this year. I'm going to try to put my all into this year and I just, you know, I just can't wait to see what we can do and I'll just need your guys to support. And yeah, sorry, this kind of this kind of feels like half of like an update video, half like a news video, but it is what it is because I don't really get many chances to really talk like this. But uh, anyways, if you guys enjoyed the video, I will see you in the next one. And make sure to join the Discord link in the description.